Three, two, one. I said we were just a bunch of kids like the Brady Bunch. Now some miscellaneous cats taking speed and in LA with us. Favorite line of coats, you can hang them up. You straight, what's up? I don't know what wrote a statement because it was state and just. I told me he was faking stuff, so I gave him. Yeah, it started out where I was making t shirts that were just suggestive to this. It started going around to different schools. Everybody really liked the designs, they really liked the concepts. We were like, man, where are the pipes? Where's the glass? So that's what really got us into like the whole glass movement. Um, as far as opening up a store and incorporating glass. And be that young to never get chicks like I get the nervous. You scare hoes to the point they don't want to get near your bed flows pulled over air low. For sure, I flow in air zones. I'm one in the same, you bed clothes. Coast to coastal, get my music like I'm postal. Go postal, we'll be your post. We got a hundred thousand dollar loan to start this place. You know, we had financial backing and it wasn't just like on a whim, oh, let's go start selling selling pipes. And then what we really were high on was how can we make this place the best place for what we call our patients. I met Derek actually through a mutual friend of ours that he went to high school with. Um, she's like, yeah, I have a buddy opening a glass shop and, you know, small world. I blow glass, like, on a free time. Rhythm, rhythm, got me high as fuck. See my stock rising up. I be never finding trust, but I found myself through the light. I thrice jumped and got ups like delivery trucks. I'm sick of cereal smucks from Imperial Clubs offering linear love. I'ma treat it like a domino and knock them down. I don't give a literal fuck. Your mineral suck. I'm a lyrical slut. Uh, Obviously, the product draws the people in here. Um, then, as far as your, your experience, I think like the employees and the people that work here kind of cater to that um, and make it what it is. Yeah. And what do you what do you necessarily bring to the table? I mean, you're, you're um, really I'd say yeah, just like overall glass knowledge. Um, but even even like that, I mean, it's it, I'm not here to sell anybody anything. You know what I mean? I, we don't push any products on anybody. Um, I just like to talk to people about glass. I just say trying to make things unique. And it's, it's a really simple equation, you just treat people good. That was one thing that was absent when, when, we, were, um, when we were customers in stores. You kind of walk in, it's not, it's not even like, hey, how you doing, how's it going? You know, it's just like, hey, ID. So one thing we wanted to do was kind of do a more like a non-traditional shop, um, just deviating from what you typically would experience. One thing with that was the um, the glass blowing studio. Watch how you step, plenty shit you can step in, and no disrespecting if you ain't in your section. Better watch how you talk if you're stalking my brethren. Forty-seven. So being able to give people an actual opportunity to see things being made, as opposed to just having um, a finalized product that anyone can have, anyone can open, pretty much for the most part, and fill cases, you know. And what's what do you think is usually the most challenging part about making something like that? I'd say focus, like you kind of have to have fun, um, but if you over focus, you're definitely, you mess up, um, but it, you, you definitely have some good and bad days as far as glass blowing goes. What's probably the best part about working here and working around these people? Uh, I mean, I come to work every day with my friends. It is a job and it doesn't, you know, I mean, it's not easy work, but it's fun. Everybody here has something to offer and is unique in their own ways, which is really going to help. Um, create a good place to grow from. The main goal is to create the best shop and best environment that you can. And we set these goals, you know, and and we create these these visions, these short-term visions, and, and then once we get that, it's kind of like on to the, what's, what's next, you know, like what, what else can we do? I'm always angry and I don't know who to blame, so I blame the government. the government. You gotta love it, another youngin' that's suffering. I told him to fuck the world and made something from nothing. Come and see how we come in the game like an intrusion. Who's him? The shade supply the beat, so I bruise and oozing. I'm losing my self-control. You niggas is lightweight, we times ten to four. And we bend the rules, they act like they don't know who the pro ever recruit. Is diamond loot is coming for they flesh, we leave them left like new kiss. And if you new to this, you see, I'll show you the ropes. I'll be your PE coach. No, you see this smoke. How you think I'm smashing records like the CD broke? CD in the back of the stoop, catching a view of the environment. I overanalyze shit inside. And be that young to never get chicks like I get the nervous. You scare hoes to the point they don't want to get their yours. Bed flows pulled over air low. For sure, I flow in air zones. I'm one in the same. You bed clothes. Coast to coast, still get my music. Like I'm postal, go postal when we oppose you. So don't go.